Good morning everyone, how are you all doing? I hope you're all doing well. So I have another vlog today. Um, I feel like I really like fell out of the swing of vlogging for a while, but now I am back and I'm really, really enjoying it. So today's vlog is quite a nice one. I'm heading into Manchester city centre because I have an event. I have a launch event at the Ivy, which I'm super excited about because I haven't been to an event in such a long time. Um, and then I'm gonna head into the shops because I need to get a birthday present for someone. And I also wanna have like a little mooch around the shops basically. Sorry, I just had to take my hair down from this claw clip because it keeps digging into my head. Um, but before we get started into the rest of the video, I want to show you some bits that I picked up from Abercrombie & Fitch. So Abercrombie & Fitch are sponsoring this section of the video, but it's definitely no secret that Abercrombie & Fitch are definitely becoming one of my absolute favorite brands to shop at. They're a brand that I'm actually starting to check like all the time to see what their new in pieces are. And I fell in love with their denim about two years ago and I honestly have not looked back because they have such a wide range of sizes. So, you know, they have a curved section, they have tall, they have petite, and they just have a really, really good amount of sizes and different like denim washes and everything like that. So that is one thing that I absolutely adore about them, but also their dresses and everything like that are so, so stunning. They do such high quality pieces and I really have been enjoying shopping with them. So I have a couple bits to show you. So I just spoke about denim, so I'm actually wearing their jeans right now. Um, so I'll show you them. And then I also have some, some beautiful dresses to show you. So I'm gonna get them quickly. So the first dress is this gorgeous little sweetheart neckline baby doll style mini dress. And there were so many features of this that I loved. I love the little puff cap sleeves with the tie there. The sweetheart neckline I think is really, really flattering. And it's a beautiful kind of crepe material as well. And the best thing about it, pockets. There's pockets. We love a dress with pockets. Um, it has a zip down the back. And I just thought this was such a lovely one to either wear on holiday, you know, I think you could definitely wear this during the day with some flat sandals, but I also think you could dress it up on an evening on holiday too, maybe with like some strappy heels. Um, but I also think it's great for wearing in the UK because I'd wear this kind of dress with like a big oversized blazer like this one I'm wearing now, um, or maybe wear it worn with like a leather jacket or something like that for those slightly cooler days. But yeah, it's just such a beautiful dress. I absolutely love it and it's just so, so gorgeous. So that is the first one. I got that in a size extra small. And yeah, I'm very, very happy, especially with these pockets. And then next up, I got this dress with holiday in mind, definitely. Um, I'm hoping to go away for my birthday this year. So this one will definitely be coming along with me. It's this black sheer dress with these beautiful kind of ruffled uh, straps, which I just think are so, so nice. And then it goes down into a tiered little mini skirt. Again, it has pockets. Whoever is designing at Abercrombie knows the need for pockets because it's such an essential. But I just thought this one would be great to throw on, you know, around the pool, by the beach, whatever. But again, it's also one that you could definitely dress up, say with some like little small black strappy heels or something like that, and a blazer over your shoulders or something. I just think that would look so, so nice. So I picked that one up as well. And then, I also picked this beautiful dress up. Now this is a little bit of a wild card for me. I don't really tend to wear a lot of stripes other than like shirts, definitely not in dresses, but I just loved the shape of it and the colors. So it's kind of like a smock style dress. So it has quite a straight neck. It has these straps here, which are adjustable, which is great. Uh, and then it just goes down into a little tiered skirt. And again, we have pockets. This just really reminded me of like, almost like a little kind of vintage style beach dress. So I just thought this would be so, so nice again on a holiday to chuck on, you know, if you're going for lunch, worn with like a nice big straw hat or something like that. Um, and some like raffia style uh, shoes, like sandals or um, sliders or something like that. And yeah, I just really liked it. It was really different. It didn't have anything like this in my wardrobe. And I could just see me bringing this on like every single holiday year after year. But again, I think this would be great in the UK, you know, for like a little picnic or barbecue or something. You could definitely pop this on with like, a, as I said, a blazer or a denim jacket or something like that. And then as I mentioned, the jeans that I'm wearing, I need to pan back so I can show you guys. So these are the jeans. Let me take the blazer off so you can see them a little bit better. Um, these are the high waist relaxed fit jeans and honestly, they just fit me like an absolute dream. Like I really struggle to find jeans that fit me around the waist or to fit me around the bum. Like normally the waist is quite loose, but this waist is just like perfect and the bum's really nice in them. They're the perfect length as well. Perfect to wear with trainers, but also great to wear with heels. Literally love them so, so much. They're so comfy too, and I love the wash of them. It's that kind of vintagey wash. And yeah, today I just literally got them popped on 
with the white t-shirt and then with like an oversized blazer and I feel like I'll just pop on some trainers just for quite a casual look but these are definitely my all-time favorite pair of jeans I tried so many different brands but these definitely always come up on top so I will link them down below if you're in the market for some new jeans they also do them in like cream black loads of different colors too so if you're looking for some other colors these would be a great shout and that squeaky floorboard is so annoying <laughs> sorry about that so i am just driving into town now i am actually a couple minutes late um because the traffic was so bad so i'm praying that i can get a parking spot really really easy but it's not very easy to park around there so we will see okay i've just arrived and i've managed to find a good parking spot now i just put my heels on because i can't drive in heels so i drove in some flats um, try and do this really quick because I don't want to be late. Okay, parking all paid for and I'm on my way. The Ivy is literally just here. Um, I found these shoes, let me show you. These heels, there. I found them in a bag that I was going to give to charity, like a charity shop bag. And I was like, oh my God. Like it was one that I'd done like a year ago and never got around to giving to charity. And I was like, oh my god, why did I give them away? I love them, they're so nice. Now I'm remembering, they're so uncomfortable. <laughs> but anyway, we're here now, so. I am so not used to vlogging in public. It has been way too long and everyone's staring. So I just finished up at the Ivy and it was so, so lovely. My car parking ran out about an hour ago, so I probably got a ticket, which is great, but I was having too much fun. I didn't want to leave. <laughs> um, hopefully I haven't, I'm praying I don't. Um, but yeah, it is now, it's only four o'clock, so I'm not really sure what to do because I was going to run into town, but um, if I go into town, I'm going to get stuck in loads of traffic on my way home because I'll be leaving in like rush hour. So I actually think I'm going to leave it for today. Um, but I might run into the traffic centre on my way home because that one's a little bit sort of less less traffic so I might head there um, because I do have bits and bobs that I need to get so I think I'm going to pop there really quickly oh, do I go into town? oh I'm not sure, I can't decide I've got loads of work to be getting on with at home as well so I don't really want to waste like too much time kind of sat in traffic it's a bit of an awkward time but, right, moment of truth do I have a ticket? let's see damn it, thought I'd got away with it so I thought I'd got away with it, but I've got a ticket. Damn it. When did he do this? 20 minutes ago. Bad times. Okay, well, <laughs> maybe I won't go into town because now I've got to pay my parking ticket instead of shop. Yeah, I'm gonna head home. Oh, I can see him over there. Um, I'm gonna head home, I think. But I might pop to the traffic centre just quickly on my way back. Okay, so I have come to the traffic centre, as you can see in the background, uh, just to have a little look around, get some bits and bobs that I need to. I'm not going to be here too long, I don't think, because I have loads of work to do at home, so I'm going to head back um, and do that. So yeah, let's see what's going on in here. I feel like they've got quite a few sales on at the minute. I'm actually just going to pop into the Abercrombie store, see if they have any more of these jeans, because I'm obsessed with them and I really want them in some other colours. So I thought I would try and tackle the Zara sale, but it's just like carnage. It's too stressful, it's too busy, can't do it. really love these little plates, so cute. I love this whole little spread actually. Even this little tablecloth is so nice. I've just got back in the car and I'm just heading home now. It was quite unsuccessful to be honest. I managed to get a little prezi for my friend's daughter from Zara. It's just like this little um, jumper and then matching leggings, which I just thought was quite sweet. It's quite cute. Um, so I picked that up and then I literally just got some wrapping paper and that was it. So a bit of a pointless trip in, but it was so busy in there. Zara was so hectic um, and yeah, I just, I don't know, I just wasn't really in the mood. I started to get a bit of a headache here. So 
um yeah i decided to leave it but i'm gonna head home now and i'll catch you guys when i get home i'm just wrapping up um some b-day presents for my friend's daughter because it's her birthday um wednesday and i just thought i'd show you what i got just in case anyone's interested in some baby bits um i just got this little set from h&m i feel like there's just no nice clothes out there for kids at the minute i couldn't find anything um really but yeah i got this little set from h&m and it also comes with like this set as well it's like a two piece a two not a two piece you know what i'm trying to say so you can kind of like mix and match which is cute so i got that and then i also got um these little like leggings i just feel like leggings and like tops are just so handy for kids um, so yeah, I got this like waffle kind of knit top in this kind of like, mm, it's coming up like orangey, but it's kind of like a rusty color. And then this is the little set that I just got in Zara. So yeah, they are the bits and bobs that I got. I always buy clothes for her because I love shopping for baby clothes personally. Um, and she always says it's really handy. So, uh, Rafi, you have had a stent stick today. Haven't you? Oh yeah, you look at daddy, say daddy give me one. Look at the weak link. You know who you can target. There we go, present all wrapped up. How cute is this little bag I got in Paper Chase? It's my favorite human and then it doesn't quite fit, but it'll do. So I am just about to jump on a call with my business coach. I haven't had a call with her in so, so long, but I just felt like I needed it. Um, so I sent her a text the other day and asked if we could book in a little session. We just basically go through like, just like everything <laughs> about like business, a little bit of like life coaching stuff as well. I just find it so, so useful. Um, and yeah, I can almost like tell when I need it, if that makes sense. And I'm just like hitting a bit of like a rut with business things, or I just feel like I need a little bit of like reassurance or just someone to kind of chat things through with, if that makes sense. So yeah, I'm gonna jump on that call now with her and chat to you guys after. Hey, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Oh, I'm good. Oh my God, it feels like so long since I last spoke to you. So I finished off my call. It's like half nine and I've just done a little bit of work and I'm gonna go and sit downstairs, watch Love Island and carry on with a little bit more work. So I'm gonna finish this vlog here. I hope you enjoyed it. Sorry I didn't do much shopping or anything in the end. It just wasn't meant to be today. It was just too busy. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye.